130 students in the Burrell College of Osteopathic Medicine will officially become doctors tomorrow. Not only is it BCOM's first ever graduating class, it will be a virtual affair. ABC 7's Hillary Florin has this story. Virtual commencement was not the original plan, but that doesn't make it any less meaningful, especially for one new doctor who got his undergrad right here at UTEP. A lot of blood, sweat, tears, everything that goes into, into fighting for your dream to become a, a physician. After years of sacrifice, studying, and rotations, Carlos Yelote is now a doctor of osteopathic medicine. Born and raised in El Paso, it's a dream he's had since he was a boy. I, I just hope to make this world a better place. I want to, my children, my all those that come behind me to feel that passion for whatever they love to do. Due to the COVID-19 pandemic, Carlos and his fellow grads finished their last year virtually and won't be walking across the stage. But he says taking his oath and being hooded in the living room is just fine with him. We're just blessed to go on to the next field and to hopefully help many more people in the, in the near future. In some ways, uh, this may be a generation of people that are prepared for technology to be uh, central to their lives. And um, uh, perhaps it's not the shock it would have been to someone such as myself who did this uh, over 40 years ago. A third of these doctors will serve here in the Southwest as part of BCOM's commitment to keeping doctors local. As for Carlos and his wife, they're heading to Michigan, where he'll do his residency in emergency medicine. Not only are we going to have to adjust to becoming new physicians, but we're going to have to adjust to this in the middle of a pandemic, in the middle of seeing highly sick people, in the middle of unknown uncertainty of what's going to happen, or even our own health, anyone's health. And to those who come behind him, Carlos has this advice. You don't have to be the most talented. You don't have to be the, the smartest person in the room. You just have to be willing to work, be humble, and at the same time have that faith in God that you can accomplish anything. And that was Hillary Florin reporting. You can watch the virtual graduation ceremony Friday at 2 p.m. on the Burrell College of Osteopathic Medicine's Facebook page. Congratulations to this first graduating class of new doctors.